Hello guys and welcome back to another tutorial. Today we're going to learn how we can show a public rank of our customers' points in our shop. The use of public ranks is very common in the gamification technique to enhance engagement through social comparison. With our plugin Git WooCommerce Points and Rewards, we will be able to create a page and show the rank using a simple shortcode and also reward each week or each month the number one customer of our rank. Now, before we start, please make sure you hit the like button below this video, subscribe to our channel and also click on the bell so you don't miss any of our videos. Now, let's start! Ok guys, we are already inside our plugin GIF WooCommerce Points and Rewards. Now, since the creation of the customer's rank is dynamic, if in our shop we already have customers that have collected points, for example, as we can see in this case, all of these customers have already collected this amount of points. So all we need to do is go from here to the Ranking tab and make sure that this first option, Enable Customer Ranking, has been enabled. Also, you will find a second option over here to show the ranking in my account. In this case, I am going to leave it enabled, but of course, you can decide if you want or not to show the ranking also inside your customer's My Account page. Now, if we go over here, we're going to find the rank shortcodes. As you can see, there are two options. You can show the rank either in a simple customer list or in a boxed list. To begin, let's go ahead and copy the simple list. And to see what it looks like, let's go ahead and create a new page from here, Pages and Add New. For the title, I'm going to enter Best Customers and now all we need to do is click here and paste our shortcode. Perfect. Now let's go ahead and publish our new page and now we can have a look. Ok, this is our new page, Best Customers and over here we can find our customers rank with the simple style. As you can see, there are also several tabs over here that will let you see the rank in different time periods. For example, the first one is the all-time rank, then you have an option to see the last 30 days, also this week, and finally to see the rank of today. Now, to compare, let's go back to our plugin so we can copy the second shortcode and see the difference. So let's go ahead. Over here, we simply scroll down and now we're going to copy the boxed customer list shortcode. We go ahead and now back to our page. Now we need to go quickly to edit page so we can paste our shortcode. Okay, in this case, all we need to do is click here and paste the second shortcode. That's it. Now we update and let's go back to our page. Now, if I scroll down, we can find the two different rank styles that we have available. The first one that we have already seen with the simple list and over here, the second option with a boxed style, as you can see over here. Now, I also want to show you some options that we can change inside the shortcodes. For that, let's go back for a moment to edit page. Ok, over here in our shortcode, we're going to find a couple of options that we can customize. For example, if we notice over here in tabs, we can enter either yes or no. Since for the moment it is at yes, let's go ahead and change it to no. Now we update and let's go ahead and see the page. Ok, over here, since we still have our two shortcodes, this is the perfect way to compare it. We have modified the tab option for this one, our simple style list. And as you can see, indeed, all of the different tabs that were previously showing over here have disappeared. And they were exactly these same tabs that are still displaying for our box style shortcode. Now, there is another option that we can customize so to show it, let's go back to edit page and the second option is related to the number of customers that you want to display in the rank. Right now we have set it to 3, but let's go ahead and enter for example 5. Once again we can update and we go back to our page. Perfect! Now over here for our simple list you can notice that there are 5 different customers showing where instead, in the box style option, we still have only three customers showing. As you can see, these are a couple of options that will be entirely up to you to decide how you want to display them. Now, besides adding the shortcode in a new page, just like we have done, there was also another option inside the ranking tab in our plugin 
to display the rank inside the customer's My Account page. So let's go back to review that for a moment. It was this option to show the ranking in My Account. If this option is enabled, the customers will be able to see their position in the rank directly in their My Account page. So let's go and see what this option looks like. So if the option is enabled, over here in the My Points section of My Account, the customers will have this information visible and available to them. In this case, this particular customer has the number three position in the rank. Now, finally, there is another interesting option that I want to show you related to the customer's rank. For that, let's go back one more time to our plugin. This time, we need to go over to Points Options and Extra Points. In this section, there is a rule that will allow us to reward the number one customer in the rank. If we scroll down, we're going to find it right here. It is the option to assign extra points for the user that collected the most points. Let's go ahead and open it. So of course, to begin, we need to enable it. And now the first option is to assign the number of points. In this case, for example, we can assign 50 extra points to the user that collected the most points. And then below, you're also going to find this option. Check and assign points on, and over here we can decide whether to do it on the first or on the last day of each month or each week. If we select, for example, to check and assign the points on the first day of each week, this means that every Monday the plugin will assign 50 points to the user that collected the most points. Or, for example, if we decide on the first day of each month, then every day one of each month, the plugin will assign the 50 points to the number one customer in the rank for the past month. As you can see, it is very easy to display the customer rank both in a custom page thanks to the shortcodes or directly inside the customer's My Account page thanks to our plugin GIF WooCommerce Points and Rewards. Well, guys, that was it for today. I hope you enjoyed the video and I will see you next time. Bye bye.